sunny weather, long sand beaches, and the ideal climate. Here we are in Mission Bay, just a short distance from downtown San Diego and only minutes from the airport. We're sitting with Captain Eric Berkey from Dive Connections and we're about ready to dive Wreck Alley. Captain Eric, can you tell us something about this dive? Okay, we're going to be diving the Yukon today. It's a 366 foot long Canadian destroyer escort that we sank offshore in July of 2000. And it's in about 100 feet of water and it's a great dive. Can't wait, let's go. Let's do it. We settle in for an easy ride through blue sunlit waters into quiet, murky depths. Our first sight of the Yukon is her mast leaning out across the sand, the Yukon resting on her port side in 100 feet of water. Motoring on, we check out more of the ship. The gun turrets, now quiet, remind us of the original purpose for this 366-foot-long Canadian destroyer. Since the summer of 2000, nature has been steadily at work transforming this gray metal ship into a floral surprise of life and color. Each year, this site will become even more beautiful, a focus for schooling fish, an entire range of life changing a vast, barren patch of sand into a flourishing, busy reef. Without effort, we can easily survey the entire length of this destroyer and soar over the many interesting details along the largest ship ever sunk on the west coast as an artificial reef. This is the perfect playground. Divers from all over the world make an estimated 10,000 dives here each year. The plans for the Yukon sinking called for her to rest upright on the bottom. But just before the ceremonial sinking, the ship unexpectedly sank and slipped away in the middle of the night. Now she lays over completely on her port side. A plaque here honors those that worked hard on this project. This dive site features one of the few large wrecks available to divers within standard recreational depths. That's why this is our favorite California wreck dive. The creation of this wonderful artificial reef was made possible by the work of many, the San Diego Oceans Foundation, the Yukon Project, and individual donors. As this animation illustrates, the Yukon has many small compartments, a maze of narrow passageways and multiple decks. Getting lost inside would be deadly. Penetration of the inner areas is for trained and skilled wreck divers only. Divers wishing to dive the Yukon will find detailed diver map slates available from the San Diego Oceans Foundation. After a day of exciting diving, nothing sums up the California diving experience better than enjoying a world-class meal with a rooftop.